Left atrial pressure is a useful measurement to help determine if bilateral B lines on lung scan suggest cardiogenic pulmonary edema or not. Start by obtaining an apical four-chamber view. To measure, enable tissue Doppler. For the lateral wall, place the tissue Doppler pulse gate just at the annulus of the mitral valve. This will give the waveform at the bottom of the screen. Freeze your image to measure. E prime is the first negative deflection. Normal is greater than 10 centimeters per second. Next, perform the same maneuver on the septal wall. Use tissue Doppler to measure the movement at the annulus of the mitral valve. Normal is greater than 7 centimeters per second. Ideally, measure both the lateral and septal E prime, although sometimes you may only be able to get one. Last, to measure the E velocity, place the color box over the mitral valve and inflow. Use pulse wave and place the pulse gate just above the tips of the mitral valve. Pulsing here gives the image at the bottom of the screen. Measure the first positive deflection, which is the E. Finally, measure the next positive deflection, which is the A wave. If the E and the A are merged together, you may have to increase your sweep speed to separate the two peaks. You can now use these measurements to plug into your formula and to refer to the diastology flowcharts to determine if left atrial pressure is high.